Corre Caminos. Penetration. Draws the foul and one. Oh, great block. And now it's uh, four on two here for Cotter Caminio. So, oh, and a big two handed slam. Here's Dominic Woodson. Woodson, difficult shot, gets it to go. Here's Martinez. Oh, good work. Gets it on the reverse and ties it up. Rostam Maport. Here's the man with it. Three from miles out is good. Here's Sintron. Back outside, Rostam Port decides to shoot the three, knocks it down. There's Trevor Gaskins. Gaskins, good aggression. And makes an easy two. Good defensive transition by... Cora Caminos. Nice pass though. They kind of switched off after doing well to prevent Sintron. Chance at all of qualification. But the second game of the day that will be starting in what about uh, just over an hour's time. Three. They need to get it away here. Martinez. So oh, not entirely sure he was aware of that shot clock. And now Rogers down the other end. Easy two. So this is both. It's a poor trip to the foul line again. It's quite clever sending Rostam Paul to that line. He was a 25% free throw shooter coming into this game today. A second placed position by Santa Telka, uh, Tekla, sorry. Clock is down to three though, has to get the three away, which he does, and makes it. So he's up to four, the lead is beginning to grow. It's an eight point advantage now as Martinez drives and puts in a nice two. With four teams trying to determine the direct Liga de las Americas champion. to respond with a three is good and Cotter Caminos just don't want to allow so the final few seconds and they missed the two and I'm not sure whether they got it off in time I don't think they did but the buzzer goes well it was a dead rubber coming into this neither San Salvador or Cotter Caminos could qualify to the semi-final phase